Hey guys, it's John, and today we are playing Dream of the Blood Moon. This is a game that came out way back in 2012 when the Slender craze was at full tilt, and I could have sworn I uploaded a video of it on my channel, but I did a quick search of my videos today, and apparently I never uploaded a video of this game, which is weird because I remember talking about it. It popped back up on Itch.io a couple weeks ago, and so I've had it kind of in my head and I decided I would give it a shot. Let's go ahead and do it. So if you don't know what the game is, basically this was one of the first games to take the Slender 8 Pages formula and try to apply it to a different game. I swear I played this, but there's no video that I have of this game, which is really weird. Oh, okay. So we're in a bed and we're going to sleep, huh? Is this us? Oh, what, what'd she do? She's sad. Oh, I think we have to collect her teardrops. Why is she being hung on a tree? That's weird. Yeah, there's six teardrops. This is a pretty cool, like, stylized game, actually. I'm excited to check it out. Hello there. Okay, bye. Six tears, six regrets, five to solve, and one misplaced. Bring them to my tree. So, believe it or not, when this game first came out five years ago, it was originally posted on DeviantArt, if memory serves correct. It's so weird, because back then, all like the indie horror games were posted on uh, IndieDB, which isn't really used as much today. If you look on IndieDB for horror games, you're going to find... Oh, there she is. You're going to find a lot of games from like 2012, 2013, when the site was used more. Nowadays, everything's posted on Itch.io or Game Jolt. Those have kind of stuck around more. Oh, hey. Okay, so we follow the sounds. I definitely remember playing this. This is so strange. Oh, come here. Are you a teardrop? What are you? Am I chasing this thing? Hi. Can I, can I please have? I'm really confused. Where, where are you going, buddy? I'm just gonna follow you. Are you trolling me right now? You, are you taking me any place exciting or informative, helpful in any way? I feel like my time's being wasted. Okay. What is that a... Uh... Okay, I pressed E. She's laying flowers at a grave. So is that one of the teardrops? That is, right? Come play with me here. Watchful eyes always on me in my secret place. Oh, apparently I have a flash flashlight. I didn't even notice that. So this is all taking place in a dream, right? Because last I checked, we were in like a bed somewhere. And now we're just... Out in a forest. In the fog. Let's see if we can find anything here. This is weird. I feel like I'm back in like 2012 YouTube again. That was the wild freaking west back then. I don't want to say it was like the good old days, but it really was a time when you could post whatever. Oh, hey, here's another one. 
Okay, so we've got two teardrops now. That was pretty quick. I did it. Oh, there she is. Okay, she's coming over here. Can I take the lantern with me? Nope, can't take anything with me. Of course not. I'm gonna have to revisit some of those older games, I think, like, uh, I don't think I ever did beat Vanish. I know, I already know some people are gonna bring up SCP Containment Breach. I streamed that game a while back, like a couple weeks ago. And, uh, oh crap. Wait, I just did a, I just did a circle. Hey! Bye-bye. Anyway, I streamed it a couple weeks ago. I do not think that that game holds up in 2017. It was great five years ago, but this was also great five years ago, you know what I mean? I do remember like, uh, Slender, the game that inspired this. That was like the game that broke horror out of the amnesia rut that it had dug itself. Because up until Slender, pretty much all that was posted if you were a horror YouTuber were like amnesia custom stories because there just wasn't anything else. Now we have horror games, you know, good and bad, popping up every single day on Itch.io and Game Jolt. And Steam for that matter. But five years ago, like, if a game like this came out, it was... It was really cool. Especially if it was made in Unreal. Holy crap. There was another game called Eerie. That was one of the first uh, free indie horrors that I saw. That was like a 2011 thing though. That was slightly earlier than this. Where am I going right now? I mean, I'm looking for another tier, but... Yeah, I remember when Eerie came out. That was like a a big deal, because it was like, oh, people can make short, free, indie horror experiences. How cool. Okay, we're back to the six tiers, six regrets thing. So far, I've only found two regrets. <coughs> Stop coughing. What, you getting sick? You want you me to stand still for a little bit? So you get your bearings back? We gotta find these tiers, okay? Yeah, sorry, I don't mean to ramble about 2012 horror gaming on YouTube. Very, a very niche subject, if I'm honest. What is this? Oh, I think we found another one. Found a third tier. There she is with the freaking flowers again. You think she's around here? Oh, there she is. Oh, she's coming towards me. She's a little faster this time. She doesn't see me. Oh no, she oh she's turning. Okay, well, you know. I'll see you later. So I think it really is exactly like Slender. Like, she just gets faster and faster the more tears you collect. I remember there being like a cool pocket dimension area though. Sort of like in SCP Containment Breach. There's a fence, ooh, there's a bridge. Let's cross the bridge. What a large map this is. I don't remember where anything is. Oh. Hello there. What was this, for like, the armies to impale themselves upon while they were sieging your fortress? What was this? What was this all about? Oh. 
There's a tall ass tree right here. Oh, there she is. This is definitely. Damn. Okay, yeah, she's right here, though. Oh, 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 she's after me. Run, 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 run. Shoot, she got me. I guess I shouldn't have let her see me. Okay, what happened? Did I get stuck back in? Did I get a continue? Oh, guys, we're back here. We're back here. I don't know if she's around anywhere. What does this do? Oh, maybe I, maybe I shouldn't have done that. What's that? I just get a candle? Sounds like... Sounds coming from this way. Hello? What the hell? Do I light this? No. Don't do it. Don't stretch your arms out. Oh, hey, this is lit up. Only one out of three, though. Only one out of three, though. Oh my god. I've gotta find three candles. Okay, so. That's two out of three. Keep doing this, keep doing this. I know she's around, though. I Crap! No! <laughs> Go away! I'm trying to light all the candles! Okay, okay. We're good, we're good. She's not after us anymore. She did get mad, though. She reached out her arms for a hug. Can you get away from there? That's where I need to go. Look, I've only got two of the candles lit. I need to get three lit for something to happen. I don't know what. If I just get one tear for this, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be upset. What does it say? Service will begin. Ceremony needs order. Listen for bells toll. Okay. I did it. Okay, go, 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 go. Okay, the bells are coming from this way. Here we go. This is the third one. Oh, what up? You can't stop this. You can't handle this. Ah, there she is again. Don't you have anything better to do? I guess there's really nothing better to do out here in this forest, right? Oh my god. She's faster, I think. Oh god, um... Oh, oh. This is it, this is it. Alright guys, we got four... We got four tiers. Who is that person following you? Four tiers, um... Yeah, great. Terrific. I just have two left. I'll be honest, guys. I don't know how dedicated I'm gonna be to finishing this. Aha! This is a this is a new spot. Okay, so this is where I get another one. What? Oh, what? Hiding here again? I can hear them searching me. Escape punishment. Oh. Oh, dude, I can't see. 
It's very dark. This is kind of cool though. It's like a little maze. Although I, I do pretty much hate ma mazes. Uh, that thought th took forever to get out. I'm just concentrating hard. I can't really see. Oh shoot. I saw her up there. Oh. Fuck. Fuck, she's totally after me, and I'm at a dead end. Is she smart, or is she stupid? Is she stupid? Are you stupid? Man, she's stupid. Oh, hey! I made out! <gasps> Found the fifth tier. What up? We just got one more. Neat. Okay. Uh, just need one more. Oh crap! Run! 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 Oh, she's totally after me too. She is over there. This is exactly where I Where I was going too, or where I came from rather. <coughs> Shut up. Stop She's coughing. Why are you coughing? Do you want her to catch us? That's right. I said us. I'm including me in this mix It's my ass on the line too. Didn't think of that did ya? Oh, it's all about me. I'm the protagonist. What about my wasted time, huh? Oh, what's this? <laughs> what's this? Oh. Fuck. Oh no, she's gonna catch us. No, 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 no. That was the place where I needed to place all the, uh, the tears. Where the heck? Uh, it's even redder than last time. <laughs> it's so red. All right, guys, we're back. And are there six? So there's three, four, five. And I don't know where the sixth one is. I think it's over here. So this is the big ass tree, right? Where is the sixth tier? Oh, no, 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 don't fall down. That would be bad. Oh, frick, she's after me. Crap, it's completely dark. Fuck. <laughs> That's... Oh no! <laughs> Guys, I got so close. Thank you for playing. You have been slain. Yeah, you're welcome for playing. Uh, where was that sixth tier? Oh. That's the one that I missed. It was on this tree like two feet from the entrance. 
All right, well, we'll just get the other five now. What is this? Okay, I've never seen this before. This was... Oh... Yeah, this was not something I encountered last time. <coughs> oh man, maybe the tier locations are kind of randomized. Well, I really hope that the witch doesn't come in here. Oh, okay, wait, this is the entrance right here. Okay. Let's go around the side. Yeah, yeah, I gotta stomp out the fire. Okay. Oh! There we go. We did something, I think. Yeah. That was weird. Okay, so this will be my fourth tier. Uh... I also got... The one with the flowers. And the maze, so... I've got just a couple more to go. I've got, um... The one where we gotta chase it, that one's always fun. Oh my god, there she is. Just like clockwork, right? Uh, and then... Oh my god, oh my god. Crap. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, boy. <coughs> Please, no. Okay, she gave up. Good. It is kind of cool that when you get up close to her, you can see beyond. You can see beyond the fog. I wish it would look like that all the time. Personally. Damn it. Alright. You know what? I gave it another shot. I'm not gonna give it a third shot. <laughs> what sucks is, like, I had that one one. I only had two left. And I'm pretty sure I knew where they both were, but... Yeah, it's just too tedious. I can't do these, like, find six find five, find eight object games anymore. I just can't. But, uh, yeah, that was Dream of the Blood Moon. Throwback on a... not a Thursday, but... <laughs> close to a Thursday. Throwback Friday. Uh, it doesn't really have a great ring to it. Let me know what you guys thought in the comments. Uh, again, this game was made five years ago. Uh, still kind of interesting. It's more interesting than... A lot of other slender clones, to be honest, but I mean, it, it varies it up enough for it to be a little more interesting, but the ways that it varies things up are with mazes, like when you go to that little pocket dimension, if you will, uh, to get the tier, or when you're in that weird fort and you're stomping out fires, those are both mazes. And that's really the only gameplay besides grabbing tears. And really, uh, the whole game is just a giant maze. Way too hard to figure out where you are, in my opinion. I, I don't so much like wandering around in the wilderness. There's some games where it works, like I Remember This Dream did it really, really well. What a fantastic game that was. If you haven't seen that video, I'll link it at the end of the, end of the outro. But, uh, yeah, just here didn't really work for me. But with that said, this was really early on in the uh, free indie horror phase of things. So, I guess it gets kind of a pass for that. Now, let me know what you guys thought, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Think critically.